We think it's really important and really encouraging that women like Angelina will share their experiences because it raises vital awareness of breast cancer and awareness of the genetic risk that some women might be living with but they might not be aware of yet. Angelina Jolie um, has found out that she had a mutation in the BRCA1 gene um, but actually the BRCA genes were first identified by scientists back in the 1990s and it's important to think that all of us actually carry the BRCA genes. In most of us those genes work fine and they carry out a really important role in the body which is helping to repair damage to DNA. So if you think those, if the BRCA genes themselves are mutated then it means that the body is, is very compromised in the way that it can handle the day-to-day -day damage that occurs to DNA. So that means that unfortunately in women who are carrying mutations in those genes that their, their cells are more susceptible to becoming cancerous. The Breast Cancer Campaign has funded almost £10 million worth of research, so that has been vital in getting us to the point where we are today, where we can tell women um, as much as we can about what their risk might be based on the genetic mutations that they carry. But where we really want to get to is to be absolutely sure and to be able to tell women that either they will or they won't develop breast cancer, because at the moment a lot of women are making very difficult decisions based on a, a percentage risk estimate for them, so they might be going through these invasive and quite difficult procedures um, which actually might not have benefited them in the long run. The advice that we would have to any women who have any concerns in light of today's story is to, in the first instance, find out as much as they can about their own family history, so who was diagnosed and what age they were diagnosed, and just make an appointment with your GP. Your GP will be able to talk through all of that information with you, and that really is the first step in, in finding out more about what your risk might be.